know how you thought it would. <sighs> no, not especially. But I'm not worried. And why is that? Because he'll be back. It is natural for him to react like that after all. And how's that? Well, it's the first step of the five stages of grief. Okay. Whoa, 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 whoa. Isn't that what someone goes through when someone close to them dies? I mean, I think you're missing something out here. He hasn't had anyone close to him die. It's him who's died. I'd just like to congratulate you both on the recent successful flotation of your business. Thank you. Yes, thank you. Was there a point where you realised you had arrived? Well, honestly, I don't think there is a point when one has truly arrived. I still find myself constantly looking over my shoulder. <laughs> I guess internet dating's a competitive business. Yes, well, when we started out, I didn't think we'd last five minutes. But everyone's worked really hard, the bank has been really supportive, and uh, customers seem to keep coming. A lot of people in the industry have been amazed at how successful you've been and how, how quickly. So where did you get the idea? <laughs> Sorry, Ollie, do you mind if I answer this one? You see, we had a lot of friends who'd been single for a long time. Yeah. It doesn't matter who we are. What matters is who you are. Who I am. I'm nobody. I told you to stop oh. that shit. Since so I'm thinking straight, look, I just thought it was too good an opportunity to miss at the time. Oh. But you don't think they'll come here, do you? Well, yeah, you would if it was yours, wouldn't you? And John was round here early looking for you. Oh, Vicky, what have you done? What the fuck am I supposed to do now? <laughs> oh, shit, what the <laughs> Almost. One more thing. Fifteen minutes after you found her, you called the police. Half an hour seems an eternity to just sit there. You did very well, though. A lot better than last time. Some parts were harder to remember than others. Yeah. You really just seem to remember an awful lot this time. Hello, man. Good morning, Chris. Miss is still not giving you any time to yourself, then. Eh? Tell me about it. Mm. Oh, by the way, Trenchard wants to see you in his office. Don't know why. His daughter starts today, doesn't she? Tell you what, she might only be 17, but she's got a blinding body. Now, hands off, she's mine. Eh? I have a job for you both. A chance to make some easy cash. For you. I don't understand. I don't work for you. <laughs> Just think about it as contracting out, using an outside source to get a job done. What's the job? That's the right question. Well, it works. Every time. And have things turned out as you expected? I never dreamed we'd be as successful as we are. It's really wonderful.